So, um, I'm going to be installing this. So I took it out because uh, I had some electrical problems and then I, I was basically backtracking on um, my upgrades and, and everything. If you've been around the web, you might have came across like a Quest alternator upgrade and it gives out more power to the car, makes it run smoother, um, keeps up with all your uh, sound system and all your electronics. The original alternator puts out about 90 amps and this Nissan Quest actually puts out about 110 to 125. Uh, there are two models um, that I've read and came across that put out different amperage. And this one I believe puts out 110. So um, there are ones that put out 125. Uh, so, so that's basically the benefits of this alternator upgrade. Comes from a uh, 99 to 01 Nissan Quest. So that's a van. And um, yeah, so it just requires a little bit of uh, modifications. So you need a belt, and that's about it. And you got yourself the upgrade, so uh, let's get into it. We have this old one. Doesn't sound that good actually. And then we have the new one. Super smooth. So I think this should fix some problems of mine. But, alright, so for the Quest, alright, so for the Quest alternator, what you're going to have to do is grind off this piece right here. So if you want to mock it up to how it sits. So this is uh, the top part and then this is the bottom. So this piece needs to get grinded down. Um, there's going to be like a little chunk sticking up so you have to match it up with uh, the, the width of this. So chop that off and then just one more modification so inside on this back side there's actually going to be um, it's going to be a press fit washer or yeah I guess a press fit like little ring metal ring you, you're going to have to bust that out <clears throat> what you can do is drill it but I did it and it was taking kind of forever so I just hit it out and then um, yeah it works like that you're just gonna have to put a big washer so it can uh, tighten down and hold it in place and that's about it everything swaps over I mean the same really and let's go so before you install the quest alternator what you're gonna have to do is right here where this goes into the slot you'll see that it's kind of open right here so you're gonna have to actually pull this bracket off can't can't tell if you can see it but um, and, and then you're gonna have to slot it a little bit further so it's not that bad you can you can just slot it about half in half inch or so and then it should allow it to move freely and and you'll be able to tension the the belt
all plugged up. Uh, time to start it up. And that wraps it up for the alternator uh, upgrade. Stay tuned for the next little upgrade or uh, DIYs. All right, peace.